fill your room up with some roses I'm staring those eyes can I stand down Now trust me this time just a face If it goes well there might just be a wedding ring Wanna fill your cup with some morning coffee Wanna tell you all the promises I wanna keep Wanna wrap my arms around you Give you the warmth you need so are, you, are you nervous? Yeah, <laughs> okay, <I'm> chill. Nervous. <laughs> shake it off, shake it off. Alright, so what's your name and where are you from? Okay, my name is uh, Lee. I'm from uh, Taiping. It's not so far from uh, Hanoi Center. Alright, cool. Yeah. So the first question is, in Asia, what do you think is the most beautiful country? Well, well, you know, I'm from Vietnam, so for me, I think Vietnam is uh, the most yeah. beautiful country. Uh, which part of Vietnam do you uh, think is the most beautiful? Well, I'm um, after graduated, I went to Ho Chi Minh City mm -hmm. and worked there a few months. But I prefer the Hanoi, so I decided to come back to Hanoi. So for me, it's uh, the north Hanoi. the more... Right. Yeah. And it's more cold here. Right, right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Next question. Um, which Asian country has the, mo has the best food for you? Well... Um, for me, the Vietnamese food, the best yeah. one. <laughs> I, I try Thai food, I try Malaysian, mm -hmm. uh, Indian, but for me, the Vietnamese food is the number one. Which uh, Vietnamese dish do you like most? I like um, um, barbecue pork. We have we have a very famous food in Hanoi called Bun Cha. It's okay. uh, vermicelli with barbecue pork, so that is one of the, the most. Right, cool. uh, I'll famous. just search for it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, the next question is um, which do you think has the most attractive people? Attractive people? Yeah. Well, I mean, mm, with the feature, do you think which one is the most the, beautiful, the, the most handsome? Physical yeah, yeah. Or for, um, most character. Yeah, more on the physical one. Um, for me, I, I think, uh, in my opinion, uh, uh, Japanese. Japanese? Yeah. Okay. I like. What features do you like about Japanese? The face. The face, they look, the shape yeah. of the face? Yeah, yeah, okay. I like and If given the chance, uh, do you think you would prefer to live in another country or you want to stay in your home country? Well, I don't travel much, so but I love my country, mm -hmm. but I don't travel much. So maybe if I travel more, it's still some country I would like okay. to stay in. But for now, yeah. you, you're happy staying here? Yeah. Do you think uh, Vietnamese guys cheat? Yeah, I think, yeah. Okay. And what percentage of Vietnamese guys do you think cheat? Sixty uh, percent. Sixty? Yeah, it's the old generation. They they cheat more than okay. young. I have some of my classmates. They live quite uh, happily. Okay. Yeah, but uh, I don't think they cheat. They uh, the man he go out often. Sometimes they uh, hang out with friends, but mm -hmm. I don't think he cheat on his okay. wife. But the the old generation, I think more, you more, know, because okay. in our culture, in old generation, um, some people they married because they must to marry. Mm okay. I mean, in uh, yeah, the summer, uh, they married because uh, their parents asked them to marry. So mm -hmm. some people they married not because of they oh, for love. Okay, yeah. You understand what yeah, I mean? But now change. young generation, they can choose uh, the person who they want to marry okay. so that's why I mean, I mean the marriage come from love so so I don't think they cheat uh, cheat okay. yeah cool are <laughs> in Vietnam do you think that um, gays are accepted or well, is still a conservative country well uh, you mean in the north and the south Vietnam or Vietnam in general what? Um, people now young generation we are quite open about the mm. LGBT um, we support. I mean, yeah. Um, if you go to some countryside, people are not really welcome, okay. but they still accept. I mean, as I know, in some country in Europe or in some uh, like Muslim, mm -hmm. it's even more worse. Yeah, right. Like they can attack. You can be killed if you are be uh, LGBT, and you are showing uh, uh, outside, sh uh, mm -hmm. outside show like emotion outside. You can be attacked or you can be killed. But I never seen here that they attack. They, I mean, uh, people here, even in Vietnam, still it's uh, it's uh, illegal to marry. But for same sex marriage, but uh, people quite uh, open about that. Oh, very so friendly. I mean, more more friendly about that. Okay. So like, yeah. can you like 
show affection in public like you can hold hands in public and people wouldn't mind that or people will still judge well I do that with my my friend and he, we, a straight friend we do that to show even because we think we chat a friend mm -hmm. but if if you don't do that much uh, too uh, ridiculous then okay, it's okay yeah, yeah. I mean, you, you do that. It's uh, in uh, polite or in uh, yeah, yeah. You understand what? I, oh, many yeah, people, yeah. Because many people they they act like very ridiculous. Yeah. So that even <laughs> too much. Yeah, yeah. that's too much for, for um, to accept. All right. I mean, yeah. Thank you. That's Thank you so much for your time. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what's your name again? Marvin. I'm Marvin. Marvin. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay. So, uh, what's your name and where are you from? My name is Christian Nogard. I'm from Copenhagen in Denmark. All right. Cool. So the first question is, what do you think is the most beautiful country in Asia? Wow, that's a very difficult question actually, because I've been traveling a lot. That's my business as a photographer. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I've been like in Burma, Vietnam many times, Thailand, Cambodia, Laos, and so on. And I actually think that that all countries in Asia is is somehow very beautiful in each way. All right, yeah. I because get it. there's a very big. Uh, how can I put it? There's a very big, it's different diverse, kind of, yeah, yeah diverse uh, culture. But one thing that all the countries have in, in, in common is that they're so nice. They're very welcome people like me. But Vietnam, for sure, is is very high on the list. Maybe number one. I don't know. But uh, right. yeah, it, it could be. All right. Thank you. Out of all the Asian countries that you've been to, which do you think has the best food? Oh wow, man! All those difficult questions, huh? <laughs> yeah. But the Vietnam and Thailand, absolutely. That's Vietnam and Thailand. Absolutely. I agree, I agree with that. Yeah, yeah, I think that's 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 the strongest kitchen in Asia. Yeah. Maybe in the whole world, actually. Yeah, sure. I yeah. actually like the Thai food also. They're yeah. very flavorful. Super and <laughs> and and, uh, and spicy in a very nice way. Actually, yeah, I great. like that. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. If given the chance to like live permanently in Asia, would you choose to live here, or you still want to go back to your home country? I would go home and I can tell you why because when I was very young I actually went over abroad. I went to the US and stayed mm -hmm. there for more than two years and I got so so extremely homesick oh, right, and yeah. ever since I always want to go back to my country Denmark but I may be traveling plus 100 days every year so oh, wow. so it's kind of uh, important for me to have a home a place to return all right thank you so much for your thank time you so and much. i hope that you enjoy your travel absolutely thank you my friend <laughs> thank have you a good day. have a good day sure is this, is this your store family yes. family business you yes oh bro we should be best friends you know best friends yeah we, let's be best friends because you have a business how old are you i'm 30. 30. yeah yes. same age young. i look young yes. but how what age do you think 23? Sure. Okay, I'll pay 1,500. 1 million. 999? <laughs> maybe 700. <laughs> yes, 700. 700. 700. So poor, like you know what? I just, will you be seven hundred? I'm oh, here the best. Because of that, I'll give you a hug. Wanna fill your room up with some roses? Wanna stare in those eyes? Can I stand down? Trust me this time. Oh, cool. <laughs> Go. Do it with passion. With passion. <laughs> Hello, uh, Philippines. Xin chào. No. Ah, <laughs> uh, hello. Kamusta? Kamusta. Yeah. Kamusta. What's your name? My name is Hi. Hi. What's your name? My name is Marvin. Marvin. Yeah. Yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, bro. Wow. No, you said seven hundred. <laughs> maybe five hundred. Oh. You get not like so bro. Wala na talaga ope. <laughs> okay, I have a lot of money. <laughs> no, just seven hundred because you know I still need to buy food for my family. Thank you so much for the seven hundred. I really appreciate that. Yeah, actually, this is the cheapest. Everyone they say nine hundred or one million. 
Yeah. This is cheaper here. Yeah. Have the next time, guys. You you visit high store. Yes, oh, Name of your store? No. Hi. Hi. H I. My lady. Hi. Oh, Mr. Hi. Oh, this is his store, guys. Do you have number? Oh, this is the address. What's up? What's up? Oh, I'll keep this. Yes. Yeah, grab it. Very, very young, but with business. How old are you? Wow. Good. So this is now 500? <laughs> no, kidding, kidding. Kidding, kidding. Okay. And then. Ah, yeah, yeah, billiard, yeah. <laughs> bata, April, April, Bata, Reyes. Yeah. <laughs> Kilala niya guys si Manny Pacquiao at si April, Bata, Reyes. <laughs> yeah, that's my luggage from High Store. Okay. Hello, Manny. Oh, yeah. Hello. Hello. Yeah, Manny, pick pocket? Okay, thank you. How much for the show? I'll, I'll come back. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, let's bring it up say hi. He's the owner, Gravity, 27 years old. And he's the owner of the store. Pero sabi niya guys, 23 ako ha. <laughs> Woo, 23. <laughs> Nagsinungaling na nga ako sa 30 years old. Guys, 32 na ako. Binawasan ko ba ng dalawa. Tapos sabi niya, younger. Iba talaga yun na gagawa ng mga talsek. Charat. Ang hirap din ang ginagawa nila na magsiset up sila. Tapos after magliligpit na. Ah, nakakapagod din yung ginagawa nila tapos tayo pag na-stress lang tayo sa trabaho oh my god I'm so stressed na talaga ang arte arte no kaya mo yung real world hindi lang ikaw yung nahihirapan oh. marami din yung parang araw araw na parang ayan magsiset up tapos magliligpit set up magliligpit sorry di ba? ang hirap ng ganun tapos hindi ka pa sure kung may bibili ba sa'yo ngayon Tapos may mga customer pa na grabe makahingi ng discount. <laughs> Ay, joke lang. O hindi, doon lang ako kay Kuya humingi ng malaking discount kasi mukhang maganda naman yung story niya. Mukhang nakakaluwag-luwag naman si Kuya. Dito humingi ako ng discount pero hindi ko, hindi ko tinataasan kasi alam ko rin naman na parang, alam mo yun, magre-renta pa siguro sila dito. Tapos yung pagod pa nila, parang wag naman natin masyadong kuripotin. Alam mo yun, dumi-discount naman ako pero tinitignan ko rin kung... Feeling ko hindi kaya, hindi ko na ipapush.